Imagine this. What if, out of the blue, Earth just stopped spinning? Picture everything that isn't nailed down, and I mean everything. Cars, your house, even water in the oceans and the air we breathe, suddenly zipping forward at a whopping 1,600 kilometers per hour. This isn't your average Monday chaos. This is a full-blown disaster movie scene. Near the equator, where Earth spins the fastest, the devastation hits hardest. Tsunamis would tower high, sweeping across the lands, and winds would howl like the world's angriest beast, turning everything in their path into airborne missiles. It's a scenario, straight out of a nightmare. Now, let's switch gears and talk about the sun pulling a vanishing act on us. For the first 8 minutes and 20 seconds, we'd be clueless, still basking in the sun's glow thanks to the time it takes for its light to hit us. But once we're plunged into darkness, it's a whole different ball game. Earth, along with all the other planets, would just zoom off into the void, no longer held back by the sun's gravitational leash. With no sunlight, plants would be the first to bow out, closing up shop on photosynthesis. This spells bad news for the rest of us, reliant on plants for oxygen and food. Sure, our atmosphere has enough oxygen to keep us going for a couple of thousand years, but with the food chain broken, we'd be checking out much sooner from sheer starvation. And don't get me started on the cold. Within a week, we'd be living in a freezer with temperatures plummeting to zero degrees Celsius. Fast forward a year, and we'd hit a bone-chilling 100 degrees Celsius. At that point, Earth would be more of an ice cube than a planet with only pockets of geothermal warmth, like Yellowstone or Iceland offering a glimmer of hope for any form of life. It's a bleak picture, but hey, don't lose sleep over it. These are just what-ifs in the grand cosmic scheme of things. The sun's still shining and Earth's still spinning, and that's not changing anytime soon, at least for another five billion years. So for now, we're safe and sound, living our day-to-day -day lives under the sun's watchful eye.